everybody and welcome back to Southeast by Midwest Beauty. Today we are going to be unboxing the Formula X Influencer, the System Addict little set. Now, I say unboxing because if you've been hanging around the blog for the past couple weeks, you would have known that I've restarted Manny Monday, meaning talking about nail polishes on Mondays. And for the past three weeks, I've been talking about this stuff. And in all honesty, the only reason I'm actually doing this video is because it's part of the way to unlock both of the badges for the Formula X. Now let's stop right there and let's talk about Influencer. So these were sent to me to review from Influencer for free. Um, I did not pay for them, they did send them to me. However, in order to keep getting things from Influencer, I do have to kind of leave reviews and that kind of thing. Now, the reviews are all 100% my opinion, and it, that's how I work on my site. I will never, um, just because I got something for free, I will never, like, rave about it if it's horrible or down it if it's not. A good example of that is if you like book reviews, I have actually gotten... Um, a couple books recently that just were not good, but I went on ahead and reviewed them on my site anyway because I'm not going to sugarcoat those kind of books and stuff, you know, those kind of products. So I want to say that. Now, I say free because, yes, it was given to me for free, but in order to keep receiving products from Influencer, I do have to, you know, participate in the badge and all that kind of stuff. Now there are chances that you could just get the products and not do anything and you may still get boxes, but I have found in my experience that the more I interact with that box's badges that they have, like in the little system, the better the chances that I'll get another box coming up. So, you know, and you also have to do the survey at the end. I think that is actually mandatory to do. So, you know, it is free and it is, you do still have to do a little work for it. So, I want to tell you about that. I will leave a link for your influencer down below if I don't already have one in my description box so that you can join if you want. It is open to, I believe, everybody. Um, not that everybody will always get boxes, but I, it is open for everybody to join. So, now let's talk about Formula X. Formula X is a nail polish brand that is currently only available in Sephora. I think it's actually a Sephora kind of brand um kind of like you know sephora collection i think formula x is kind of that for them it's very hard to find any information about formula x on formula x's actual actual website almost everything directs you back to sephora which makes me believe that so there were three products that were in this box the first one was the system which is this little thing here and as you can see, there's a little open slot right here. But this is for manicures. And the way that this works is it is a four-step little system. You cleanse your nail after you, you know, when you're about to polish them, you cleanse them. And this dries almost instantly. Then you prime them. Then once that dries, you put on your two coats of nail polish. And once that dries, you put on your top coat. So this was the main product. Now, if you buy... You can buy these individually at Sephora, like the cleanse, the prime, and the top coat, if you only want one or the other. But it winds up being a little cheaper to buy it as the set, plus it comes in the little magnetic box. But you also get a free nail polish color of your choice. Now for the Influencer box, I believe they sent everybody TGIF, which is this corally shade, which is actually very, very pretty. Um, I'll link the blog post down below for all of the reviews for these products and you'll be able to see what this looks like actually on the nails in one of the video in one of the posts. So I'm gonna take these out so you can see what each bottle is. They are all full size bottles. Alright. Now, like I said, this is the first step. Oh, oh, and one thing I do want to mention about Formula X is they're similar to Butter London. These little outer but a little easier because butter lemon, you gotta like really pull that apart. But um, these outer parts come off so that it's a little easier for you to use with this like little round cap here. Okay, so the cleanse, what it does is it basically just cleanses the nail. Not a lot of manicure places have this. I actually think in on um, Sephora's product page for this, it actually is like proprietary or something like that. So you put this on and like I said, it dries instantly. So once this is dry, 
you come in with your primer, which basically, you know, it's, it's, it's a base coat. It primes the nails, getting it ready for the polish to stick better is what it does. And in the post for this one, I break down each individual one. All right, and then after that, you come in with a nail polish, which also has the pop-off cap. And like, as, it, as I said, TGIF was the color, and it's this coral shade. And then the last step is there. Talk about, and the nail polish fits right in there. And this set is $39.50. Um, and like I said, when you buy it from Sephora um, online, you actually get to pick up polish to go in that little slot for free. It's included in the $39.50 price. The um, nail polishes are $10.50 outside of, you know, like if you want to buy extra colors or you just want to buy this nail polish. And then the last step is the top coat, which is a shine top coat. So it's not like a mattifying one or anything like that. It's a shine one. Okay. So one thing, the, the reason that this is the system is it's supposed to give you a kind of a gel like manicure at home for not as much of the price. Um, I will say that once you, if you use all the steps with the nail polish, it does give you that kind of poofy kind of um, look to the nails that actually does look very similar to a gel manicure. Now, I've never had a gel manicure. I do know that they are very, they can be very damaging to the nails, especially trying to get them off. Um, it's in cosmetology school, we're not even learning gel manicures. We're learning like just actual manicures. So, um, this is also supposed to be chip resistant, and sorry, I keep fidgeting with this, and it's supposed to give you 10 days of wear. Now, I will tell you that um, when I tried this on, I tried it, I think, like the first or second week of cosmetology, my last semester of cosmetology school, which is this semester, woo! Um, so, I actually was like shampooing my mannequin, some other students, and stuff like that. And usually, due to that and all the computer usage that I do, um, I usually get like second day I'm chipping, if not the third day. Now, um, for this, I actually, the picture of the manicure that is on the blog post is actually five days in, and there's very little chipping. Now, here's the thing. Once the chipping started, it was like, all downhill from there so day five I had chipping and by day 10 it was like it would look like it looks now it was it was ratchet so um, now if you're easier on your nails then you probably will get that 10 day wear but for me I did not get it that being said I am kind of rough I do want to explain that so if you do a lot of dishes and stuff you probably might would get that you know four to five days without chipping but once it starts to chip it'll kind of go you know downhill from there if you're someone who doesn't do a lot like you use a dishwasher you use the computer but you know it's not that's really the only thing rough you do then you might actually get closer to that 10 days than what someone else would so I did want to mention that the last thing that was in the box was this formula X delete all remover and Inside, I'm not going to open it right now because in the blog post for this one, which will be linked down below, I actually open it. I show you what the inside looks like. It is a sponge. Um, I did see someone on one of my social medias say that they thought it, would, it looked like charcoal, and it really does, but it's actually a really super soft sponge. If you go to Sephora and they have one of these open, don't use it because that is very unsanitary, but do kind of like touch it to see. It is really super, super soft. It does have five pockets on the inside that you could stick all of your fingers down at one time. I suggest letting them soak for a second and then kind of just twisting the bottom a little bit and then kind of like bringing your fingers up and down while you twist. I found that that works the best when getting this off. Otherwise, you'll have some left around like the cuticle and up around the edges and stuff. So the reason I'm not opening this is because for my, I don't know if this is all of them, but for my particular one, it does not always want to go on, the cap does not want to go on evenly. And I found that when it doesn't go on evenly, it likes to leak. But it, and it takes 
like an act of Congress to get this thing to go on evenly. Like I said, I don't know if that's all of them or if it's just mine, so do beware. I don't remember it doing it initially, but after I took the photos for it, it started doing it. So I don't know if like my lights kind of warped it a little or what happened, but I do want you to be aware of that just in case you have children. Uh, once you open it, you might want to kind of test it a bit before you let them just kind of roll it around and play with it, especially if you have like wee little ones. So, uh, I just kind of wanted you to be aware of that. That was everything that came in the Formula X Influencer box. Hopefully you enjoyed. Make sure to come back on Wednesday because on Wednesday we'll be unboxing another Influencer box. And on Friday we will be talking about the Mac and Star Trek 50th anniversary collaboration. I already did a first impression of that on the blog, uh, which you can go check out but I will be actually reviewing it on Friday, both on the blog and on YouTube. So make sure to come back both of those days for that. Make sure that you like this video, give it a thumbs up if you like it, and make sure to share it if you like it. Uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And I will actually tell you something, if you are subscribing to people and you're noticing, especially if you're um, doing it online, and you're not getting like notifications, uh, you like to get them sent to your email and it's not doing it after you hit the subscribe button it'll turn gray it'll say subscribe and you'll see a little box that has like a little gear right next to it if you click that a pop-up will appear and it will say uh, get email notifications and it'll have a little check box that will be unchecked if you check it and then close it every time that person uploads a video from then on you will get an email as soon as they upload so just to let you know about that so if you want to get email notifications so you don't always have to come back to youtube to check my channel make sure to click that as well and if you're already subscribed you could you should be able to scroll down and see that little gear as well so make sure to follow me on the social media link down below for behind the scenes little peeks and until next time bye